Hello, and welcome again to Chemistry with Mr. Olson. Our topic today is units of heat, calories, calories, and joules. Calories, calories, and joules? Why two different types of calories? Well, notice the difference. There's a lowercase c and an uppercase c. And sadly, that's how we have to keep track of the difference between chemistry calories and dietary calories. I've uh, put the essential information that we remember on this uh, sheet. One chemistry calorie equals 4.184 joules. These are the, ter the units that we typically use to measure heat or heat energy in chemistry. Now a dietary calorie or a food calorie is equal to a thousand chemistry calories. A chemistry calorie is the amount of heat it takes to raise the temperature of one gram of water one degree C. And uh, that's a tiny amount of energy. It turns out for food calories it was more convenient to use thousands of calories or kilocalories and they ended up calling it the same name so we distinguish with the uppercase C. All right, so let's um, Let's use this information to do a couple of problems in the homework. Here's our homework, our heat worksheet. And question number nine will be the first one we'll do. Actually, let's start a little earlier. We've already addressed question number four. The energy content in food on package labeling, that's in units of big C calories, also known as dietary calories. So that's how we would write that with a very clear uppercase C. Um, one calorie, well, that equals 4.184 joules. One big C calorie equals 1,000 calories. So, 60 big C calories is, of course, 60,000 chemistry calories, or little c calories. 2,000 joules, how many kJ, or kilojoules? Well, Kilo means a thousand. A kilogram is a thousand grams. A kilometer is a thousand meters. So two thousand joules is two kilojoules. Fifteen kilojoules is fifteen thousand joules. All right, now one of my favorite things conversions. Um, a substance gains eighteen calories of energy. How many joules is that? Well, this is our standard given times conversion factor. So we write our given, 18 little c calories, and we want to convert to joules. So, tiny dot, horizontal line. On the bottom, we write the units we're going to get out of, cancel. Calories over calories will cancel. We want to get into joules. And we know, then we can fill in the numbers, one calorie is 4.184 joules. And uh, the units cancel, calories over calories equals one. So there we have um, our, our problem, 18 times 4.184 to two sig figs. That gives us 75, and the units is joules. Okay, next problem, very similar, number 10. Uh, substance loses 18 joules of energy. How many calories is that? Well, if we're losing 18 joules of energy, that is minus 18 joules. Let's convert to calories. Divided by, we're going to get out of joules, so we put that unit in the bottom, into calories, and then we fill in the numbers that make this a valid conversion factor. The top and the bottom have to be equal. One calorie equals 4.184 joules. Joules on top, joules on bottom, cancel, equals, do the math, we div take 18 divided by 4.184, and we get 4.3 calories. And there we have it. So, uh, 
hope that helps. Have a beautiful evening. And keep your uppercase C and your lowercase C very clear and distinct. I will be looking for it. Ta-ta.